With heavy U.S. military equipment headed for Eastern Europe, Russian-American relations are beginning to resemble the Cold War. How do you believe we should approach our relations with Russia going forward? Well, I believe in peace through strength, and I think the um, uh, foreign policy that our country has uh, put out the last few years has caused uncertainty and showed weakness to them, and so I believe we need to be strong. Uh, we need to make sure that we are supporting our allies. I think sending uh, more equipment is uh, important. Hartzler also criticizes current federal law requiring agricultural products to be labeled with their country of origin. She's co-sponsoring a measure that would repeal labeling requirements for beef, pork, and chicken. The House recently sent that measure to the Senate. The reality is uh, consumers really aren't looking at those uh, labels very much, and it has jeopardized our position with our most important trading partners. The Senate on Wednesday on sent President Obama a bill that would streamline his ability to negotiate trade deals. But the House hasn't sent over a companion bill to cover the costs of retraining workers whose jobs are displaced by trade. Hartzler calls that measure redundant. Well, the Trade Adjustment Assistance Bill uh, would add an additional almost $1 billion a year uh, that to an unproven program of retraining workers. And there are already programs in place to do that, which I support. The Senate has not yet held any hearings on the country of origin labeling bill. As for the Trade Adjustment Assistance Bill, House Speaker John Boehner says he will bring it up for a vote if it passes the Senate. Reporting for KRCG 13, I'm Garrett Bergquist.